also going to be some rain around to begin with. That's mainly in the west, but it looks as though it's going to edge its way eastwards during this weekend, probably getting stuck in the northeast. And it's a general trend to something much more unsettled over the coming few days. And it's very unsettled across western parts of Europe as a whole. A lot of clouds and rain too. And that cloud has been pushing its way northwards across southwestern parts of the UK, bringing with it some rain. Not a great deal, and it's turning lighter and more patchy, but still some rain across parts of the southwest, particularly Cornwall and into the Channel Islands as well and certainly a lot of cloud through the rest of the day. Now we've seen that ribbon of rain pushing its way into parts of Northern Ireland, probably seen the worst of it uh, now. Still a rare, very grey and cloudy scene across Belfast, but it should turn a wee bit brighter as the afternoon goes on. Now, we've got some bright weather in Aberdeen, also got some showers very close by. We're likely to find most of the showers probably in the Northern Isles. And in between the showers in the northeast and that cloud in the southwest, it's a much more promising story. We have some bright weather, plenty of sunshine, but it's not too warm. Temperatures of 13 to 15 degrees, but with that wind, it really is probably going to feel quite cold if you're out and about. The wind keeps blowing overnight, and although we'll see some clear skies overnight, Temperatures of 6 or 7, not too bad. We will keep more cloud across Scotland, still a few showers across the northeast of Scotland. Cloud in the southwest as well. We should see the back of most of that rain, though it's never too far away, even into tomorrow. And southern counties of England probably having a rather cloudy day. Could be the odd drop of rain around as well. We'll have the showers across the northeast of Scotland and later some drizzle across the northwest. But again, it's this central slice that sees the best of the bright weather and the sunshine. Again, with the strength of the wind, particularly in the north, it will feel quite chilly. As we approach the end of the week, the strongest winds will be across the north of Scotland. It's going to be turning wetter, the rain developing across many northern and western areas towards the southeast should stay dry bright but again a lot of cloud. Signs of change as we move into the weekend, some progression. These weather fronts starting to edge across from the west, slowly but surely dragging their heels across the northeast of Scotland. So we'll see some rain. It should clear away from the southeast during Saturday morning from the northeast of England in the afternoon, hanging on across the northeast of Scotland, and then brighter showery weather following on behind. Signs of some more rain into the southwest by the end of the weekend. Hannah.